channel. Thanks, like I always say, as always, for clicking on the video. I do appreciate it. Thanks for being here. So, a uh, couple quick things I just wanted to touch on today. Uh, let's, and I'll go more into these things on Sunday's live report, but uh, just a couple things I just wanted to, to brush on quickly. So let's do that. So orders at the shop. Um, obviously, we're in a uh, we're in a pandemic. Everybody knows this. I don't need to uh, to go into detail on that. Everybody knows what's going on. Um, we've decided at the shop um, that. The, the people like myself and Bob, um, we're not going in there right now. Uh, just because it's a smart thing to do and it's a safe thing to do. Bud is still in there. Uh, Bud is the owner. He's still taking care of orders as fast as he can. But uh, I, what, what I'm asking is please, please, please uh, bear with us as uh, we get through this. Um, if you've already ordered things, paid for them, we have those orders. We're going to get those done as quickly as we can. We're going to get them out to you. And if you're looking to put orders in, I ask that you just call the shop and talk with Bud. Uh, it's phone number 231-882-424. It's either 882-4242 or 887-4242. I think it's, it's one of those two. Anyway, if you look up Tangle Tackle Company in Manistee, you'll find that number. So if you're looking to put an order in, you're still welcome to do so. Uh, you're still going to get that March Madness discount. And uh, But just please understand that uh, the, the progress right now has slowed. Um... We're, we're doing everything we can to, uh, to do our part to help out. So I, I appreciate your consideration there. All right, the second thing is, um, and I'll talk more about this on Sunday's live report. Like I said, I was able to speak with Sean at Best Lure Company up in Canada. Uh, we're back on track. Uh, nice guy, um, avid fisherman. Uh, we, we spoke for quite a bit on the phone and then also text, have, have texted back and forth. He's got those plugs coming for the field testers great uh, we're, we're right back on track with that and uh, he, he is really excited uh, to be working with some Great Lakes uh, guys and gals out there out there testing out his stuff so and it, his stuff is good I'm gonna tell you that his stuff is good all right um, the purple taco the naming of those five flies I'm gonna put a link down below actually I can make a link pop up right here um, so what if you want to help name those flies, remember you got to go on that on that video, and I'll put that link up there. Go on that video, and some people just weren't understanding how to vote for them, and I get it. Not everybody does YouTube, no problem. Um, it, when the fly, when I show the fly on that video, you're going to see a little white dot pop up. You click on that; it's a poll. You got five names to choose from for that fly. Make your vote. When the next fly pops up, you can do it again for each one. You're going to see that thing pop up, and you can make your vote on there. Um, uh, for for the name that you want, and we got like seventy or eighty votes already. But I'm gonna for each fly. Uh, we're gonna I'm gonna disclose the uh, the finals or the final names uh, this Sunday on Sunday's live report. All right, cool. Uh, and another thing on Purple Taco, um, some a lot of people are asking about this, and it's come to fruition, which is really cool. Um, a couple weeks back, one well, I can't remember who it was, and I apologize. Somebody asked me if I would have had, if I could only have five flies um, from the recipes on Purple Taco's website, which fly, which five flies would it be? And so I gave those out. So what uh, Lee and Deb at Purple Taco did, they made those into a kit. Uh, so it's called Chris's Picks or Chris's Top Five or something like that. If you go in their kit section on their website, PurpleTacoFlySupply.com, you'll find those kits there. And uh, what Lee described to me was you're going to get enough material but the kit comes with everything you need bullet heads material um, thread beads um, you name it it's there you're going to get enough material and everything to tie i think he said like 10 to 12 of each of those five flies and it, the cost is like 50 or 60 bucks so man that's a pretty sweet deal you're going to get a bunch of flies uh, made up at a pretty uh, reasonable price. So way to go, Lee. That's a great idea. A lot of people were asking for that, so uh, that uh, was the motivation behind that. And they listen to you guys. You guys leave comments down below, or you leave comments on the Sunday uh, fishing report. They li people listen. That you guys are the uh, driving force behind this uh, this um, this fishery. Uh, these companies they'd love to hear your voice. All right, cool. And the last thing I'm going to talk about real quick is the Patreon thing. Don't forget. Here's a 250 copper made up by myself. Um, if you jump onto our Patreon, and I'll put a link down below for our Patreon. If you jump on for any amount, I don't care if it's a dollar or a million dollars. I love a million dollars if you can spare it. But uh, if it's just even a dollar, I don't care. Um, you're in a drawing 
for this 250 copper on a brand new convector CV55 reel. This is a nice rig. We run these on our boat all the time. Um, you're in that drawing. And we're like a quarter of the way there. We got, I think, 24 Patreon subs subscribers on my last count. Um, and I said, when we get to 100, I'm giving away a free charter. So we're a quarter of the way there. Um, cool. Somebody's going to get a free charter down the road. I, I, I have, I, I believe we're going to get to 100, maybe more. But uh, for all of you in the interim, in the meantime, I'm going to be giving away things like that um, just to show how much I appreciate you guys helping us out. All right, so thanks to everybody that's uh, helping us on Patreon. All right, that's it. I will see everybody Sunday at 7 p.m. live uh, right here in my beautiful basement. If it gets warmer out, I'm going to start moving back outside and back to the shop. And I know, uh, I'm pretty sure, well, actually, I was at the bank today. Everything is, uh, I'll talk more about this on, on at Sunday's report, but I am pretty much the owner of the new boat now. Um, paperwork has been signed. I'm I'm knee deep in it, guys. Nobody, nobody scared me off too bad. I'm I'm ready to go. Pre like right there, probably eighty percent of the way there. But yeah, everything's done at the bank. All we gotta do is sign the paperwork for the boat, and we're running. But yeah, I know. I'm looking forward to doing doing some uh, live fishing reports out on the water, um, like while we're fishing, maybe even during a charter or two. So that'd be fun. All right, guys and gals, see you Sunday, seven o'clock. Be safe. Take care.